Hey everyone, Dr. Rex Hamilton here, Hamilton Eye Institute. I am really pleased to have Luke here with us. We're gonna talk about some kind of newer technology related to replacing the natural lens of the eye. It's called a light adjustable lens. Luke had actually some cataract right. at your young age. In both eyes, yeah. Um, and we, we kind of think that they were there for most of your life and just actually got worse precipitously, relatively recently, right? And so we decided to use the light adjustable lens for Luke, and I wanna kinda of talk about just the process. So uh, why don't we start with what was happening with the cataract? What, what was going on with your vision that, that brought you in to see me? My vision started getting blurry, and it happens over the course of time, probably I wanna say six months to a year. And you know, just like anyone else, you just wanna forget about it. You know, just like, oh, it'll go away. And it didn't, so I got a little worried. And then when I went to an uh, eye doctor for glasses or just to check out my eyes, Philly was kind of shocked by what I had. And she's like, you have cataracts. I'd like to see you see a doctor for your health issues. So after two or three specialists, because I was, you know, it's, these are my eyes. I'm kind of panicked, you know, and, and I was like, wow, I really have to go get surgery or what, what's going on? And then I met you and then it, it was awesome because your people or your staff is amazing. I mean, you're so easy to relate to and, and you made me feel at ease and that comfortable. And you, you play baseball. I mean, you're, you're like a really good baseball player, and I know that's really important to you. And I think you had mentioned that that was, yeah. you had actually stopped playing or you didn't feel comfortable for because, a whole of the, year. because of the vision. Yeah, for a whole year I stopped playing, and I mean, if you get hit in the head, you could die. So it's it's kind of a major thing for me. And, and, and I see, like, I was like, oh, baseball, baseball, but then I realized, wait a minute, this is my vision, I can't see no more. So, you know, you really don't realize what you got to lose it. So we talked about the procedure and where we remove the natural lens of the eye, which is cloudy. That's what a cataract is. And we do that using laser. And then you're seeing out of the eye immediately, right? We right. do one at a time. I think we did the second one. One a week after the other. A week after the other. Okay. Let's go through the process of the actual day of the surgery and kind of how it was from your, your perspective. On the way here in the morning, we got here early, showed up. I was really nervous because I mean, my eyes are getting operated on and they put me, lay me down in the bed, getting ready for surgery. Then you showed up and everyone was super nice. And I just, it made me feel at ease because I mean, my eyes are my eyes. I don't have any more than two. <laughs> so the surgery was pretty smooth. I was pretty shocked how fast and rapid and easy you made it and how comfortable it was. You know, I was awake the whole time and I was expecting different, something different. Like, Give you a little IV sedation. So yeah. You took, took the edge off a little bit. Yeah, relaxed, you know, and then after the, the laser surgery, I mean, I came out and I could see again out of my other, my, the worst I had, and I immediately started crying because I mean, I just, it was amazing, you know? It was, I remember that, he, yeah. he, the nurses came, your, your patient's crying. Yeah. I was I like, was, that, that big guy, he's over there crying? <laughs> yeah, it was, it was the best feeling ever, you know? And you had mentioned, let's get the other one done next, the next week, I said, absolutely. So you went home and the vision the next day, how did I feel the next day afterwards? Amazing, I mean, I, I could see everything. Was there pain, was it? It was, Slight pain, not much. It was maybe a little irritation, you right. know, but not really pain. I mean, even the whole procedure wasn't very painful. You feel a quick shock or maybe some awkward feeling, but I don't remember ever being in any severe pain or anything. Yeah, so with the light adjustable lens, we can actually do the procedure very close together within a few days of each other. We let the eyes heal for about a week. Mm -hmm. We bring the patient back. And we measure like for glasses. I put you behind the machine, which one's better, one or two. Right. And we kind of figure out what's left over. Is there a little astigmatism? Is he a little nearsighted or farsighted or whatever? And then we can do what's called a test drive. And we can actually put a contact lens in to say, make one of the eyes a little more nearsighted, send him home, do all the stuff you want to do, come back and tell me how you feel about it. Right. Right? I remember that, yeah. And so then, Luke comes back and he's like, oh, this is great. I can see my phone, I can see the distance. That's awesome. Let's go to a room in the office. I'm gonna shine a light in your eye and we're gonna change the power of the lens and correct you so that you can see like that for the rest of your life. We can do that up to three times. We make little adjustments up to three times. I think we did a two, couple. One, or one, on one, one adjustment on one eye and two on the other. And it was right. just, you're right on the money. And then, and then tell me about that, just that process about the light adjustment and how that works. I mean, well, technology nowadays, it's just, I was flabbergasted because you put 
my eye in a machine, you put a lens on it, and I go through this UV light scenario, like light show kind of thing, and, and it, it's it's weird, but it was pretty amazing. And that, after that was done, I could see even better. You know, and I had, and when we adjusted it again, we went the second time and you locked it in and then the, the other eye and, I mean, my vision is amazing. What I can see now, the colors, how far, how near, you know, it's like I can read again. And it's right. like, I, it's just amazing. Like so this, this lens is remarkable in, in several senses. One is that it's the only lens that we can actually do this adjustment after surgery. So all the other lenses that are available, I have to figure out, you know, what's the right lens power for Luke's left eye, okay? And his, eye is his left eye is different than his right eye, and both of his eyes are different than the next guy, okay? And I've been doing this for 20 years, and I'm pretty good at figuring that out, but it's not 100%. So let's say the lens power is off, and we wanna change it. Well, if I use another lens, we gotta go do another surgery. Take the lens out, put a different one in. Not with a light adjustable lens, because we can just shine a light in the eye which takes about 60 to 90 seconds. That's it. Um, and change the power super precisely. It was just so easy. I mean, the, it was a, you're, you're an amazing man. That's all I can say, because you know, every time I came here and I got a treatment, it was so fast, so in and out the door, so convenient, and it made it, you know, so painless. You probably stopped riding the motorcycle for when you had the cataracts, right? I did, I did. You Hopefully know, for I, your own safety. I, I, I sure did. And the safety of others. Absolutely. You know, I mean, I got, I was a little stubborn at first and, you know, my wife was, you know, worried about me and I said, all right, I'm going to stop writing until I get my, my eyes fixed. And I didn't, these are my eyes. I want to make sure I go to the right person who's going to do the right job and have it done correctly. And it was you. So how about the baseball? Oh, baseball is amazing. As soon as I went back, I could hit the ball. Wow. You know, I was locked on. I no way. And I hadn't played it over a, a whole season. And all the guys were just like, oh, it's, we had new guys on the team, and they're like, oh, this guy can't hit, this guy can't hit. <laughs> he's washed I'm up. I'm sitting there coaching, he's old, he's done, you know, and... and this guy's got cataracts over here, man. He, oh, he's, yeah. He's done. I told uh, the guy who took my spot, I go, you know, I'm coming back to replace you. <laughs> so, you know, <laughs> and he looked at me like, yeah, right, old man, you know, and sure enough, you know, I got to play the last game of the season in the playoffs, and I went two for three, and he went 0 for three, so... There you go. That's all I can say about that one, you know. So a couple of things about the light adjustable lens. It is a process to go through the adjustment. So it's not, you know, day one, everything is exactly where we want it to be, but, but you understand that. I explained that to you. And it probably takes several weeks to really go through the adjustments. And then once we know that's where we want to end up, we do actually what's called a lock-in treatment, which, which basically freezes the lens so it won't change ever again. Right. Ever since my sight's been amazing. I just, I can't complain. I'm the happiest guy in the world. Congratulations, sir. Thank you. Absolute pleasure taking care of you. Oh. Um, and hopefully, if you know, if you folks out there are having trouble with your vision and maybe you've been told you have cataracts, uh, please come in and let me take a look. Uh, we have a number of options. Sometimes the light adjustable lens might not be the best option, but, but the nice thing is, you know, I, I, I've had the experience with all the different things. So we customize every single patient in terms of what I think is best. So look forward to seeing you at the Hamilton Eye Institute.